What is this place? Another one? I think that was bigger than last time. Do you think the Kunad Gate is expanding? We don't have time for chit-chat. We need to keep moving. Wait, Wait a, a moment. moment. That voice. Please, Please listen, listen to me. <gasps> Mother? Huh? What? Huh? That's... Your mother, right, Yuito? What is she doing here? And Kasani, what did you just say? This is a vision created by Babe. What an underhanded trick. Wakana was a precious person. She was a successful design children model, and she had the power of the red strings. My mother was one of them? And she is important to both Yuito and Kasane. Wakana took care of Kasane when she was little. I heard she fled from Togetsu after an incident. I thought those Togetsu bastards killed Mother. That's what I remember anyway. So, Yuito's mom ran away from Togetsu, and then met his dad in Suo? Chairman Sumeragi may have provided refuge to her. Once he found out she was connected to Togetsu. That is why I thought this form would be best to get you to listen. Yuito, Kasane, you must know. This world is in danger of destruction at the hands of the Kunad Gate. It is not only Togetsu. There are many people living in Suo and Seiron, all over New Himuka. To save all of the people who are important to you, I must have your help. Help? Yurito, I apologize for leaving you alone while you were still young. If you come with me now, your loneliness will be cured. Kasane, do you remember that puppy? That little dog was your friend. If nothing is done, everyone will die. All your friends in the world will die just like your puppy. Will you both help me? Connect your minds and become one with me. Use the red strings to save the world. Don't use my mom for your dirty schemes. Mother wouldn't say things like that. You're not fooling anyone. Is that the best a machine can come up with? You really underestimated these two. A foolish decision. The brain of the Wakana that you love has already been processed and made a part of me. What did you say? Ugh. Are human brains being used as organic parts for Babe? So then, that means my mom wasn't attacked by others after all. It was you, Babe. No. Togetsu! You stole my mother's brain! All of it was to save the world. What do you mean, save? You're only saving yourselves. You can't sway me with visions of mother. You don't want us to get any further. I won't let you use my mom anymore. I will stop, babe! is collapsing. I'm glad everyone's all right. What is this place? Something feels different. What? The floors again? This is bad. Everyone, run! Sugumi, is there a place we can teleport to? This is the only path. Wait. Another is coming. It's big.
We may have fallen, but at least it wasn't to our deaths. So this is the real Babe? That's right. We should be able to access all of Babe from here and shut it down as well. Oh, it looks like something's already processing. What's going on? Babe is implementing emergency procedures. Could it be because we made it this far? Hmm? I felt something just now. It felt like the red strings. What's going on, Arashi? I can't believe it. It's totally empty. Huh? What do you mean, empty? I meant just what I said. All the data has been erased without a single trace. Feels vindictive. So you mean Babe shut down of its own accord? I like your wishful thinking, but something just doesn't seem right. Regardless, it doesn't look like Babe can do anything anymore. So is it safe to say we've managed to stop Togetsu's plan? I'd be lying if I said I was completely free of doubt. But at least at this point, it's clear that this computer is useless. The connection is restored. Hey, are you guys okay? Oh, it's Wataru. The network blocker must be gone. That must mean Babe really is shut down. You shut down Babe! Fantastic! Another earthquake. I feel like it keeps getting stronger. Wataru, that quake. Yeah, another anomaly was observed at the Kunad Gate, and they're becoming more frequent. I'm glad we stopped Togetsu's plan, but I don't like that we lost all the research data. There could have been information on the Kunad Gate. Hey, Kagero, Kyoka, is the research data safe somewhere else, or do you know someone who knows about it? 
It's very unlikely. The research of red strings spans over hundreds of years. It's a power filled with mystery to begin with. There probably isn't a single person who understands the whole thing. So we have no leads? Guys, there is someone. She's involved with Togetsu and is knowledgeable about the red strings. Who? Wakana. She fostered Kasane, who has the power of red strings. She must have had enough knowledge to be able to raise Kasane to control it. What are you saying? Yuhito's mom is dead. So we should go ask her directly. Directly? You can't be serious! By using the red strings? Yes. We don't seem to have any other options. Even still... I'm worried. It may damage Yuito's brain. Let's do it. If we don't do anything, the Kunad Gate will just keep expanding and bring the end of the world that much closer. I want to do everything I can, even if it doesn't work. Let's use the red strings. And we'll do everything in our power to help. So, what exactly are you going to do? If we're going to make this work, we need to keep strong emotions in check. Let's go to the Kunad Gate. I've jumped from there before, so I think it'll be easier to remember the feeling. You want to recreate what happened when the gate opened? All right, let's head there. gate has it always been that big it's definitely expanding but it's still smaller than what it will be in 50 years this place brings back a lot of memories the red strings i think there's a good chance this is going to work okay i hope i know what it feels like we'll give you sas support we should be able to boost your powers if we link our brains together there's no telling what kind of dangers there will be, so it would be best to come back to the present as soon as possible. In order for you to have the greatest chance of success, you need to have an exact time and place to jump to meet Wakana. October 4th, 2009. The old OSF hospital in Lokusho City. If we go there, I know we'll see my mom. That was the day she died. I was in the hospital then, so it's definite. The others attacked Lokusho City that day, so the hospital moved to its new location in Suo. Alright. I don't know if it'll work, but let's try envisioning that place and time in our minds. Are all ten of us going? A group that big will stand out in a hospital. About that. Like my teleportation ability, I imagine it will be too stressful on the brain to move that many people at once. So... Should we narrow down the amount of people that are going? Kasane, this may be difficult to hear, but I believe you jumping alone would have the lowest risk. Luca? Regardless, those without the power of the red strings will be pulled back after a set time has passed. If we were to go with you, it would needlessly increase the strain on you and Kasane. Then I'm going too. I can't let Kasane go by herself. 
No, I agree with Luca. Though for a different reason. Yuito, if you meet your younger self, then there's no telling what might happen. It may just be a theory, but I think it's a risk we can easily avoid in this attempt. But if I make sure I don't see myself... No, I guess we can't be sure. But Kasane going by herself... I won't be alone. Everyone will be supporting me through the SAS. And since you have the same power, if you stay here, you can act as a marker for me to return to the present. That's what I think, at least. So I'm like a beacon. Okay, but don't try to do anything crazy. I won't. I promise. Give me your hand. Lend me your red strings. Of course. It's the least I can do. If you're trying to recreate what happened, my power should help. All right. Let's begin. Try to imagine it. Eleven years ago at the OSF hospital. And mother. be waiting for you. This is the same as before. What is this place? The place where Mother has... imagine it in my mind. The old OSF hospital, 11 years ago. Where am I? This is the hospital, right? Information for patients. Today is October 4th, 2009. I jumped right to when I wanted. I sort of have a sense of the red strings now. I don't think I can use them repeatedly, though. I should start looking for Mother.
You're Kasane. Oh, I... Huh? One day, I received a memory from the future. I saw you in Togetsu. I guess Babe won its wager. It proved the potential of the Red Strings. Mother, what do you mean? I don't understand. The brains of past users of the Red Strings are connected to Babe's core. None of them were as strong as you, though. Babe used those minds to create pseudo-red strings to transfer data across time. To red strings users in the past. Transfer? So the data wasn't erased. But how do you know that? I felt a tug from my brain inside Babe. Its data was transferred into my head. Uh, is that even possible? Babe took a risk so that its plan wouldn't be foiled. A huge amount of data was transferred into me. It felt like my head was split open and I fainted. When I woke up, I was astonished at the information I was given. Even so, I'm sure I wasn't sent all the information. That's how I learned that you were alive and well. This isn't the moment for reminiscing, though. I'm sure you're short on time. Thank you, Mother. I want you to tell me what you know about the Kunat Gate. Is Yuito's death really the only way to destroy it? Yes, it is. As long as Yuito lives, the world will be destroyed by the Kunat Gate. Uh. Which is exactly why I made the proper preparations for that not to happen. Now, while the Red Strings are active, is my only chance to try it. Bring me to your time. All right. I don't know the reason why, but I'll do what you say. Wait. First, I have to find Yuito. Find him? <laughs> We're playing hide and seek. It's all right. He's hiding right over there. I finally finished the device to protect Yuito from memory damage. Is that the ear cuff that Yuito still wears? It's actually a tag the OSF hospital made to manage special patients, but this is a special order. If you swap this for the one Yuito is wearing now, he'll be all right. Then we'll go to the future. Okay, then we need to get Yuito. Oh, Yuito, wait! Another warning. It's starting. I'll keep you safe, Mother. Let's go after Yuito. Others could show up at any time. I have to find Yuito fast. Yuito isn't in this direction. I have to find him. You, Yuito. Yuito! Mother, look out! Thank <laughs> you. 
I made it. Just in time. Oh, oh, oh. I'm sorry. Explaining will take too long. Just let me put this on you. Oh. You see, Wakana... Your mom asked me to make sure you wear it. Y yeah Okay. You have to live, no matter what. Are you all right? Is anyone hurt? Get this child to safety. He's Joe Sumeragi's son. Uh, understood. Come this way. I put the cuff on you, Ito. Thank you. People can see us here. Come this way. All right, then. Yes, let's go. This'll work. I need to think of Yuito and return to my time. Take me to your time. It's the same as the vision Babe showed us, which means... Mom? Why are you here? What's going on? Yuito... Mother! We'll talk later. Her brain must be under a lot of stress. Let's find a place to rest. But won't she be pulled back to her time while resting? Don't worry. Though weak, I am a user of the Red Strings. We need to hurry back to the hideout. Wakana should be fine once she has some sleep. There's no damage done to her brain. It seems like it was just exhaustion. Good. I'm glad it's not serious. She said she could stay in this time for a while, so let's give her some rest. If it's true that Wakana has Babe's research data, then that's a hopeful sign. That reminds me. There was something we talked about inside Babe that had me curious. They were making others, but is that the same metamorphosis technique as New Himuka? It might be. It's very likely that Naomi was shot with a special bullet that contained other particles. I never could figure out how much New Himuka actually understood about them. But if they have the technique to incorporate other particles into a bullet, they should be able to do something about the extinction belt. If neither New Himuka nor Toketsu can do it, managing it must be very difficult. Perhaps it has something to do with the amount of particles. The extinction belt is made of other particles, right? So the others that fall from the sky must have been some kind of animal before. It's not birds. We learned it's in the stratosphere. But then, what animals could they be? Well, they most likely came from outer space. Outside the extinction belt. Like the moon. You're almost right. There's a moon station on the outer edge of the extinction belt that contains genetic information of many animals. Or so they say. 
So the others falling to Earth was instigated by the moon too. That means no matter how much we fight, the others will be born infinitely. That's so awful. How could they do that to the people on Earth? It's unforgivable. Very. But I'm sure the people on the moon were desperate to escape metamorphosis. Not that I'm saying you should forgive them for that or anything. With the moon's technology, they should have been able to counter it. But there was no way they could save the entire population. It's in Dr. Pope's memories, too. People terrified of other attacks. <sighs> well, we have to wait a while to talk to Wakana. So can't we just slack off? I mean, take a break? You don't have to correct yourself. Slack off all you want. We'll save all the talk for after my mother wakes up. I can't forgive the people on the moon for what they did. But if people are suffering from metamorphosis on the moon, too... I'm sorry I made you all worry. Are you alright? I'm fine, and we have to hurry back to the Kunad Gate. We're going back there again? Do you know what we can do about it, Mother? Yes. We must get rid of the entanglements in the Kunad Gate, or the world will eventually be destroyed. Entanglements? What are they? We should head to the Kunad Gate before I explain it further. Okay. Then we'll go to the Kunad Highway. Everyone get ready. Mom, you can have a seat here. Thank you. You got so big. Huh? <laughs> that was sudden. You joined the OSF. How's Kaito? Are you getting along with your older brother? He's good. We don't really get along anymore. Oh. Can you tell me what's happening in your time, in the present? And that's basically it. The only other thing is the existence of the Kunad Gate. Thank you. Along with Babe's data, I think I understand a lot now. Are we almost ready to leave? Oh, yeah. We are. Let's go, Mother. Is something the matter? I'm just happy you turned into such a fine young lady. It's not my place to say that, though. I'm sorry I left you behind and ran away. It's okay. You don't need to apologize. They were trying to kill you, and I don't remember much about being in Togetsu anyway. And after I came to Suo, I had my big sister. Then I have to say thank you to your sister. I'm sure she'll be happy. You still call me mother, even after everything. Things are moving fast, but I'm hoping you can tell us how to deal with the Kunad Gate. You said something about entanglements? Ultimately, Yuito and Kasane have to enter the Kunad Gate and unravel the entanglements. What I'm telling you here is just a concept. The traces interfering with time should look like tangled red threads. According to Togetsu's theory, whenever you jump through time, a dimensional hole like the Kunad Gate is created, but it should then disappear. The reason this hasn't disappeared is because Yuito and Kasane's powers resonated. The Kunad Gate is different from the theorized gates in that it's persisting in a distorted state. Using a distorted gate for a time jump creates entanglements. If you can unravel those entanglements, you can close the Kunad Gate. 
distorted. I don't really get it yet. But when you say, enter the Kunad Gate, do you mean go into that hole in the sky? That strange space. Is it inside the Kunad Gate? You saw it too, when the gate first opened. Oh, that place with all the weird images? That's right. That strange space that Kasane mentioned exists inside the Kunad Gate. It is a concept of space that only exists for those with the Red String's power. Togetsu called it the Kronos Terminal. Perhaps it's a kind of station, or junction point, for traveling through time. Hmm. So only Yuito and Kasane can perceive it. I guess that explains why we didn't notice it when we jumped to the future. When there is time contact between 2020, when the gate was made, and another time, entanglements are created. Time contact? Is that any different from time travel? It's a broader definition of time travel. Even if you don't arrive at that time, even if you just attempt. Basically, if someone with the Red String's power even touches that time, there is a trace. That is time contact. The only way to actually see which times have entanglements is for the two of you to go and check for yourselves. So I guess the only thing we can do is leave it to Yuito and Kasane. Even if we find the entanglements, we won't know how to unravel them until we see them. The Kronos Terminal is conceptualized by your powers, so you'll know how to unravel them. Not with reason, but with intuition. Also, I'm weak, but I can use the red strings, so I'll support you from here. Okay, so we just need to use the red strings again and enter the Kronos Terminal. I'm going with you this time. You don't know what kind of dangers will be there. Make sure you're ready before you go. If it gets dangerous, you both come right back. Don't worry, we will. Just take care of my mother. Keep her safe. It's all right. Don't worry. We will protect Wakana. All right, we don't have much time. Let me know when you're ready. I got the hang of using the red strings now. Yuito's here this time. I have to do this right. Good to go, Kasane? I'm ready. Focus your consciousness together. Picture the site of the Kronos Terminal. To the Kronos Terminal. We will unravel those entanglements. It looks like we actually made it. Are each of those images connected to different times? We can't just stand around. We have to search for the entanglements. <laughs> I guess it's nothing new when it's your third time. So, how do we find them? I don't feel anything yet. This is... It must be Mother. Is she guiding us? Let's go! Others? How are they inside the Kronos Terminal? Calm down. That place is built from your consciousness. It's an imaginary world. It is a very unstable place. Your fear and anxiety, all of your emotions affected. The memories of your past made others appear. So basically, you're saying that these others were created by our mental immaturity. <laughs> that makes us sound pretty lame. But if we made them, we can take them down, too. I know the two of you can handle it, but be careful. So if our 
consciousness has made it. Is this other an illusion? It sure looks real. As long as your brain thinks so, it's the same as if it was. We have to fight it. Yes. This is the old OSF hospital on that day in 2009. It's an entanglement. Yeah. I don't understand it, but I can feel it. This is definitely it. If we want to successfully unravel this, then I'm betting that we have to use the red strings, our power. Yes. I feel it too. We should be able to make this work. Ah, another one! Let's hold it off while we unravel the entanglement. All right. I know we can do it. Right, Yumi Tell? Yeah, right. You are. Let's go. That seems to be the useless check. Fine. <laughs> Great job. That was a good move. Let's keep going. I'll try. Us together. It should unravel. This will make the Kunad Gate disappear. Hey, Kasane. That day, I never got the chance to thank you properly. So, thank you for saving me. What? That came out of nowhere. You were the one that saved me 11 years ago at the hospital, right? I remember it perfectly now. I used to be a dud, and then all of a sudden I had powers. My power awakening? 
I think it was because you shared yours with me. What? Powers aren't something you can just share. Yeah, I know what I'm saying sounds silly, but if it were possible, it was thanks to meeting you that day that I'm still alive and have reached my goal of getting into the OSF. That's what I think, so... Thanks for saving me. You're welcome. Is that what I'm supposed to say? <laughs> you look totally confused, but that's okay. I think it's unraveled now. Everyone is probably worried about us. Mother's power. I can still feel it. So, there's more than one entanglement? If so, it's simple. We just have to unravel all of them. Right. Okay, let's go. We did unravel that entanglement, right? <laughs> I think so. But something still feels off. So you feel it too. Something's bothering me. There's another one. Is that 50 years in the future? That should be gone. This is the other that attacked Yui Tom. Can you handle it? This future should now no longer exist. Have you ever thought about what you would do if you could travel to the past and change history? You mean, after we remove the Kunat Gate? Yeah. The ability to travel through time freely. That's the true power of the Red Strings. Right. If I could go back and save my sister, I'd be lying if I said I hadn't thought of it. I wanted to save Naomi. I just kept thinking there must be a way over and over again. Every now and then I'm reminded that I won't see her again, and it rattles me. 
Sure. If I could change history so Naomi wouldn't turn into another, if that was something I could actually do, I don't think I'd do it. Why? Because if you change the past, no one knows how it will affect everything after that. If we were in a different platoon, if we weren't scouted, if I was never adopted, is changing the past until I get the results I want really saving Naomi? And not just Naomi. It's not right to go back and change the lives of everyone in the world just for my own selfish desires. Yeah, I guess it's not right to mess with everyone else just to fulfill your wants. It's painful, and there's a lot of suffering we have to bear. But it's a burden we must carry. Sorry, it was weird of me to bring up. That being said, I am glad I asked, because I was thinking the same thing. I'm relieved you agree. Oh. But this mindset is thanks to you. I've learned so much. The same goes for me. I think my old self would have come to a different conclusion. I mean, I don't think you would have even talked to me for this long, back when you first joined. You know, that's not... Okay, perhaps you're right about that. This is Mom's... There's still an entanglement? But all the time periods we travel to... No, now's not the time to think about it. Can you keep going? I'll be okay. I'm probably just a little tired from using my brain too much. We should hurry. You only traveled to those two times, right? Yes, I think those are the only ones. Isn't that... The Sumeragi Crest. That's it. This is the image I saw at the start. Right. Yakumo Sumeragi's Crest. It seems like a time entanglement appeared then. What? How? Former Major General Karin! So they're going to keep coming. We need to unravel the entanglement. I have no other choice. I can do this. The trap needs to be taken out. Okay, that should... <sighs> Yuito? This is bad. I don't think I can take much more either. So... Did we do it? That should be all of them, right? Probably, but something doesn't feel right. Karin and Yakumo Sumeragi... What happened to them? <sighs> Damn it! I'm blacking... Yuito! Kasane! Mom? Mother...
Where am I? Oh, good. You're awake. It seems like we made it back. What's going on? The Kunat Gate... Why hasn't it disappeared? Well... Good job, you two. It's all okay now. What? But... Mother, we unraveled the entanglements. So why? <sighs> Leave the rest to me. What? Thank you for growing up so strong. You've made a lot of wonderful friends. Those connections are much more valuable than any red string. Treasure them for the rest of your life. M mother <laughs> Mom. You can't go back to the past. If you go back, Toketsu will. It has to be done. Forgive me. The longer I remain here, the more painful it will be. No, hold on! There's still so much that I need to say! Mother! Yuito, Kasane, live on. Knowing you're happy is all that I could ask for. So today is the day. I may give you my brain. But you can't have my memories of the future. Kaito. Yuito. Kasane. The body has been confirmed as the target, Wakana. Current theory for cause of death is cerebral overload due to a malfunction in the personality rehabilitation device. We believe an irreversible memory wipe was conducted. There is significant damage to the memory regions in her brain. Following protocol and retrieving her brain. I see. There was an entanglement from when Mom time-traveled. Mother... She explained it to us earlier when the two of you were gone. The Kunad Gate wouldn't disappear as long as she was still present in this time. We have a message she left for the two of you. Let me send it to you now.
Kana knew from the start that she was causing an entanglement. She held back her feelings so she could part with you with no regrets. She's a great person. I'm sorry. I know this hits the two of you harder than anyone else, and I'm here crying. That uneasy feeling we got when we unraveled the entanglement 11 years ago was because Mom's entanglement still remained. Wakana wasn't from this time period, so her situation was different than yours. Hey, um, don't be so down. I'm not saying that because I'm worried about you. I said that because it affects platoon morale. I know she would have wanted to talk to the both of you some more, but she thought spending more time with you would only make things more painful. Apparently, the entanglement will unravel when Wakana returns to the past and dies like she did in history. That's strange. Wakana has returned, so how come it didn't disappear? Have all the entanglements truly been unraveled? All the entanglements we felt we unraveled. The ones 11 years ago, 50 years in the future, and the one during Yakumo Sumeragi's time period. What? What does Yakumo Sumeragi's time period have to do with anything? I think one formed when we witnessed Yakumo's assassination. What are you talking about? Yakumo was severely injured in an accident, but he wasn't assassinated. We don't really understand it either, but we saw Yakumo Sumeragi being killed by Karin. What did you say? We were busy dealing with the entanglement, but yeah. There's no doubt in my mind that that was former Major General Karin. He copied Kasane's power. Yuito, if he also copied your power. But he didn't copy my... <sighs> he could have time-traveled by resonating Kasane's power with mine. So it hasn't disappeared because of the entanglement Karin created when he traveled back to Yakumo's time period? But the two of you couldn't find an entanglement. How do you expect to unravel something you can't find? Karin can unravel his own entanglement. Yes, exactly. The only thing we can do is take Kar into the Kronos Terminal and have him unravel the entanglement himself. Wataru, can you check Karin's location? I figured you'd ask, so I've been working on it. I've got nothing. I can't find him at all. It's like he's disappeared. Supposing that he's traveled to Yakumo's time period, that would mean he's in the past. That's where you're going to find him. Are you too sure the people you saw were really Karin and Yakumo? We're sure. We could see their faces clearly. Actually, we only saw Karin's face. But that was Yakumo. I mean, he had the same mask on as all the depictions of him. Ah, uh, yes, that's it. The mask. That explains everything. Kagura, explain. Whoa, Sugumi, calm down. So, you know how Yakumo started wearing the mask because of the injuries he sustained? Rumor was, sometime after the accident, he suddenly stopped appearing in front of people and his whole personality just changed. Whole personality changed? You're not suggesting... The real Yakumo was assassinated by Karin from the future, and Karin took his place by putting on the mask? It doesn't matter. Either way, we still need to travel back to 2,000 years ago to check. Actually... No, we might not have to travel at all. You all saw my brother's video, right? Don't you remember what he said? Yakumo Sumeragi is alive! What are you... He 
he is asleep, deep beneath Suo. Even now, he is waiting for his revenge. Right. Cold sleep. Just like Kagero. If Yakumo is in cold sleep under Suo, then we can find out the truth by meeting him directly. If former Major General Karin replaced him, then he'll be the one down there in cold sleep. I'm not entirely certain as to why he did what he did. But we can talk to him and have him help us unravel the entanglement. Do we know where he's sleeping, though? I mean, Arahabaki is the only area I can think of that's under Suo. I mean, Sumeragi Tomb is the first place I thought of where Yakumo would be. Do you think he would really be in such a heavily trafficked place, though? How about it, Yuito? It's your family's tomb. Yeah, that makes sense. But I've never even been inside the building before. The head of the family is responsible for watching over Sumeragi Tomb. I might be able to find something out if I talk to my brother. The Chief! Do you think he'll listen to us? Actually, I've been trying to reach my brother's terminal, but I'm not getting through. There's a chance he might have blocked me. Wataru, can you ask Major General Fubuki to talk to my brother? I doubt he'd refuse a call from a Major General. Okay, leave it to me. I just don't know how soon I'll get a response. Wanna stop by our hideout then? I'm sure Yuito and Kasane could use the rest. Good idea. It would be smart to rest while we can. Thanks, Gemma. All right, let's head back. Welcome back. I messaged Major General Fubuki. He said it might take some time to get in touch with the Chief. Thanks, Wataru. I also asked about Major General Karin, but apparently Major General Fubuki doesn't know anything either. I see. Then I guess he really is in the past. We don't have any other leads at the moment, so let's hope he's in Sumeragi Tomb. I guess I should talk to Kagero.